like you guys probably can see from the thumbnail, I found some lost snow goose footage from North Dakota, and these are just, actually this is kind of the third day we were there. None of you guys have seen the third day because we ended up hunting that morning. Me and the crew were late to the field. Uh, we ended up shooting probably 30 or 40 more that morning. But these are some lost GoPro angles, awesome footage that I stumbled across, and I was like, oh my gosh, that's where it went. Thank you! But really, really quickly, a lot of you have been asking, Bobby, when is Ducks going to get the Paracord back in stock? Well, it's back. Yep, the Freedom Lanyards and Totes. Oh yeah, check out them bad boys right there. Oh, they are pretty. But the Freedom Lanyards, the Fatties, the Little Fellas, the Camos, all colors are back in stock. And today, and today only, we're doing 15% off for Father's Day only. Once these are gone, they're gone until September. So use code DAD15 to receive 15% off your entire order today and today only on anything Ducks related. I will link all the products in the description below. Go click on it, go pick you something up and support the channel. I'm gonna get back inside and spend some quality time with the family. Since it is Father's Day, I wish all you guys a happy Father's Day. Enjoy the video. <laughs> we thought these were cranes. I mean, they're so big, you can't tell when they're that far away. They're huge. Look at the flock of snows. Gotta be. Oh yeah, they're just gonna do it, boys. They're just gonna do it. Well, here we go. We got them working. Finally sat down, running light. We are, not them. They've been here since uh, shooting light, but they've shot 43. Not bad for, not bad, I say not bad. That is so good, this spot is amazing. This spread and setup is just beautiful. Those Rossies are quick. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Get in here. Back up. Oh yeah. Oof. Here we go. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, my gun stopped too. Another one going down. Boom. Seriously. Yeah. That's my grader's decoy way better. <laughs> I'm we do whatever. Shoot up. Golly. Why? Goodness. What? 
I couldn't hit junk. They were way up there. Yeah, they were pretty high. He's going down. Oh yeah, coming over your shoulder. Now we're rolling again. Spray into. Yeah, God, that's a, that's if they if that would ball up. <laughs> That'd be a mess. <laughs> <sighs> yeah. Yep. Yo, the one thing about this video, I I warned you, it was extremely short. But the one thing about it was, uh, me, Preston, Brad, and Noah, we got to the field late that last day. Now, here's the reason why. We were extremely whooped. You know, the 10 hour drive there, you know, we got there, uh, barely got any sleep because the first night we all, you know, had some beverages together and, you know, got to know each other and we all stayed up late. So that next morning we worked our butts off. If you guys have seen the other North Dakota videos, you'll see how muddy it was and we ended up getting stuck and getting the quad stuck and then having to go to a car wash. I bet you they paid like 80 bucks to wash them full body decoys. It was crazy. The main reason was is because I have Sprint uh, and it's horrible. Whenever I go out of the city pretty much, which is all the time because that's you know what I do because I hunt, I had no reception and that first day where it was so busy, so hectic, I didn't even think of saving or dropping a pin at the field so I know where the field is the next day because it was the same field before. but. We're talking North Dakota, a lot different from Kansas. And if you don't mark your location, yeah, you don't know where you're going. So I struggled with reception issues, getting a hold of Hunter that morning. And yeah, it was just a messy communication and uh, we ended up getting there late. But when we got there, they, they had shot on the video, you heard him say 43. They had already downed 43 birds before we got there. We pulled up and this, group of juvies just balled up when we're in the truck so we pull up we're on the road watching this group of juvies just ball up and they go Pfft. i mean literally wiped out like 20 and one set right in front of us and i was like fellas we're late so i just wanted to give a little explanation of why that video turned out the way it did why there wasn't much content it, it was because when we sat down the, the hunting really slowed down uh to a to a minimum as you could tell and uh, so I just kind of shut the cameras off. It, it just it wasn't worth it at that time. But looking back, it's always worth it to keep the cameras going and to get to the field on time. So next time we'll be dropping pin saving locations, especially when I'm out of state, not knowing where the heck I am. But guys, like I told you, all of our paracord is back in stock. A lot of you guys have hit me up asking, Bobby, when you guys gonna get it back in? Well, we got it in now. These are limited quantities only. So if you guys have been wanting a gun strap, ton of you been wanting a gun strap, we only have like 15 of those things in stock. So go pick you up whatever paracord item you want, whether it's a lanyard, a game tote, gun strap, any of the styles and colors there in stock. It will not stock up till September 1st. So if you're wanting it for till season, I suggest you grab it now. I will link all those products in the description below. Go check them out, guys. I want to thank you guys for sticking around. I know this was a very short video straight to the point but i wanted to get something up for father's day keep all my dads out there fellow dads entertained on this father's day because i know it's hot out and a lot of us duck hunters like to be in the ac and watch some duck hunting snow goose hunting videos so if you guys enjoyed the video give me a big thumbs up and if you have not subscribed you know what to do we'll see you on the next one peace